think both the Internet of Things and AI have huge potential for good, but great potential for being misused. You have a good side and a bad side. It's a big threat, apart from an opportunity. It could be the best ally or your best enemy. My feeling is that both Internet of Things and artificial intelligence will improve our life in some ways, but there's also room for some kind of detriment, right? I mean, the Internet of Things has many advantages in the sense that it can make our lives much more efficient, so it can improve the way in which we manage our time. I help human beings by advancing the quality of life and increasing the productivity and the convenience of life. Uh, it makes the world smarter. Well, definitely this will do for our life and uh, we definitely have to eat. In some ways, IoT devices can be great, in some ways they can also be kind of annoying. <laughs> it needs to be more due diligence and understanding of how you achieve what you want to achieve. But it has proven to be uh, supportive in the uh, in the progressive world already and we can suddenly manage all kinds of human behavior and activity. Well, it's very dangerous. It's, I, I believe that it's very dangerous. Well, there are problems regarding the privacy. The problem is about security. At a point we can't control what we put on the internet. I mean, the negatives, uh, as we see, are purely security. You have the issues related to privacy, the issues related to security. We need to be uh, very, very much uh, disciplined. The obvious biggest challenge with the Internet of Things is that all things will connect, but how do they connect in a way that we expect and we choose? And many people uh, risk in the short term to lose job because of Internet. Uh, I don't know if we'll be living in a society that we don't have to work anymore. So we have to be very thoughtful about how much we're willing to depend on this autonomous software running and how much we have to be careful and be thoughtful about how we use it. There are so many um, disruptive technologies entering uh, uh, the, our lives that you know we are just getting used to it. And sometimes people look at disruptive uh, technologies as being a negative. Disruptive technologies have brought us to where we are today. Like any technology, they're value neutral and so it's really in how people implement those tools. Almost anything can be abused by those who want to. I'm optimistic that we will soon find the balance between utility, ubiquity, and, and also safe use. With every uh, technology, there are positives and negatives. Uh, eventually, we are able to overcome the negatives and then take the positives on. I think it's going to change our life dramatically in every aspect of what we do today. Unless we do AI responsibly, it could be the biggest mistake of, uh, of humanity.